Uh, there's that saying, "Tis this." I think it's like t- "Tis the season to be jolly." I believe, or either that, or it's part of a song, or it's actually just both a saying and a song. But uh, the actual closer to reality truth is that the season is extremely fucking salty because this fucking game. And I also have this person blacklisted as well. So that's always an amazing start is when you have not only a blacklisted person, but a guy in division with said blacklisted person. So um, that ought to be interesting. Uh, let's see. Only three battleships. That's un- unfortunate. Uh, Buffalo, Seattle, radars. Neptune, potential radar. Jotland, Cossack, and Shiratsuyu are all going to be problematic uh mahan not so much but still might be annoying uh what do you want to bet the chances of those radars being at cr i'm just gonna say fuck it and i'm gonna take the uh risk Fun fact, if that is a uh, Radar Neptune, the same applies to any Radar Royal Navy uh, light cruiser, is you can actually bow tank them in a destroyer. You can bow and a stern tank one, but it, the stern tank kind of depends a little bit on the specific ship you're in, because some destroyers have a bit more of like a flattened ass, basically. Uh, The U.S. destroyers come to mind. Uh, The British destroyers come to mind. Uh, The VMF come to mind. Uh, Those types of ships that have like a more flat like ass basically. uh, Those have a higher risk of being penned by Royal Navy armor piercing. But if you're in like a Kagero or something that has like more of this rounded off end there you can actually stern tank a uh, royal navy radar with very good effect for surprising effectiveness and also that iowa's afk so that's already just an amazing fucking start to the game we have a blacklisted guy in a division and an afk iowa so that's always an amazing uh beginning uh Nothing is in Contesting C yet, and I haven't been radared off the map. Who's this guy? Here's an advantage of the uh, having the much shorter gun range on the Kagero is because you can uh, do stuff like that, fire off a quick snapshot, and never be detected for it. Also, I don't know why that rig up f- fucking radar, but uh, whatever. Anyway. Uh, let's see. Ch- I'm gonna do it. Fuck you, man. I also love how it says I reported the Sherborg, but you know, it's been a glitch with this mod for quite some time. So, it's whatever. It was pretty much what I expected. Uh, I don't know where the Cossack is. Shiratsuyu's down there. Uh, I don't want to go after the Shiratsuyu if I... Okay, Cossack is up there. So that's good for uh, me. That was actually like a really nice hit on him.
There's Mahan Torps. Just on the edge of torpedo range there. This is about to be an aggressive move, but I'm going to bank that the fact that the Mahan's not going to turn up and into my entire team right there to get this off. I also don't want to get too close and get into that guy's smoke firing penalty. Uh, let's see, Iowa finally woke up, so that's nice. I do want to try and kill this Mahan, though. Oh my god. He is pretty low. Well. Oh well. That was a waste of a torpedo reload, but I guess he's dead. I'm not. So, fuck it. I also don't want to uh, push into that Mahan with my gun turret still turning. This is a mistake I see a lot of people make, uh, especially with the Japanese, Or, but really it applies to any uh, slow gun, slow turret traverse ship, is that you never want to push while your guns are turning. And meanwhile, uh, this Iowa is about to just eat a fucking head full of torps. I do want to head up to C though. Or D. Oh my god, why are you broadside? Whatever. What the fuck ever hits Fine, it's all fine. Shatsuyu's probably gonna get himself clapped out here pretty good. Yep. Uh, I don't know how a self respecting Shatsuyu manages to die like that, getting caught out by a fucking Riga and New Orleans without using the use of radar, but fuck it, I guess. Uh, let's see here. That Masashi is not going to be in range here. So I want to get a bit of damage going on this Jutland here. And we have a nice convenient radar. I have a nice convenient very short firing detection penalty. And that is why I run stock gun range on the Kagero. And pretty much most destroyers for that matter. Alright, so... I was killing himself on purpose, IRL in the game. So that's uh, always amusing. New Orleans and Riga are probably going to be able to kill off one Surrey. Maybe, question mark. Uh, Alaska's going to get himself farmed out here. Oof, that, oh my god, he's out of, okay. 
That's fine. Those aren't going to hit, which is unfortunate, but I am radared, but only for a few seconds. I think that uh, that guy panicked, hit his radar as soon as, um, as soon as he got clapped out as hard as he did. Z31 is killing himself. Musashi's turning all the way away, which is kind of annoying, but it's whatever, I guess. Oh, I managed to hit that Cossack. Not what I was aiming at, but... Okay. I might even hit that Turpitz, too. Nice. It's a shame that the one target that those were aimed at, the Musashi, is the one that didn't get hit. It hit everything except him, which I find kind of amusing in a really stupid way. But whatever. Here's another reason why I run the stock gun range. Can't be too greedy and uh, keep firing here. If I keep maneuvering. Turpitz is probably typing, typing up his accusation as we speak. There we go. There we go, that works. He's burning. I think, I actually think he repped that fire. So if any of those torps hit, that's, he's just going to be dead. Yep, there you go. That Seattle... I'm kind of hesitant to turn up into C and back around, even though that would provide the better angle. Just because I don't know where that Seattle is. He has been spotted in three minutes, which is actually interesting, but uh, it's whatever. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to play it safer for now. Uh, as New Orleans should be dying here shortly, which gives me a little bit, yep, more time to get some, uh, damage, hopefully. I want to, okay, I could have made that turn, but whatever. Uh, let's see. Of course, the massage is turning away. I'm gonna wait for the Masashi to fire before, uh. Well. No, I wanna get closer to be able to maybe torpedo that Neptune smoke. Although, actually, in all honesty, could be a fucking radar Neptune. And I'm just getting, like, turbo bamboozled here, but... Oh, 
Well, that Musashi's about to die. There we go. I didn't mean to do that, but okay. I just kind of accidentally got a Kraken. Imagine accidentally getting a Kraken. But I won't complain. Uh, what's that guy doing? Yeah. This game's over. And I did it all without saying anything. Anything toxic in the chat. I think I think that right there is the biggest accomplishment from this game is I didn't say anything toxic even though I really fucking wanted to so anyway that is going to be it for today seeing as this is being recorded on the 24th which does happen to be Christmas Eve I hope anyone who's watching this who celebrates Christmas uh, have a Happy holidays and all that good stuff. Spend time with your families, uh, your spouses, SOs, whatever. Uh, if whether it's your pets, your body pillows, any of any of those uh, that deserve attention. But uh, that will be it for today, and I will see you tomorrow.